Good morning students. Welcome back to our geography lesson on North America, Land of Prairies. In this lesson, we will be studying the location, physical setting and extent of the continent of North America, the physical divisions of North America, climate and vegetation of North America, agriculture of North America, important minerals and industries found in North America, and the population of North America. The temperate grasslands of North America are known as the prairies. The word prairie originated from Latin word priata, which means meadow. It is a region of flat, gently sloping or hilly land. For the most part, prairies are treeless, but Near the low-lying plains, flanking river valleys, woodlands can be found. Tall grass up to 2 meters high dominates the landscape. It is actually a sea of grass. The prairies are bound by the Rocky Mountains in the west and the Great Lakes in the east. Look at the map of North America. You can see that the prairies cover parts of United States of America, and parts of Canada. In the United States of America, the area is drained by the tributaries of Mississippi and the Canadian prairies are drained by the tributaries of Saskatchewan rivers. The grasslands of prairies were the home of Native Americans, often called Red Indians. They were the actual inhabitants of the continent. The prairies were home of other tribes also like the Apache, the Crow, the Cree, and the Pawnee.